Hi, this is Cooking Mama. Today I'm preparing for a pumpkin meal. I'm making the stock first. Inside here, I've put in uh, two shallots and one garlic and fried the, all the heads and the shell of the prawns. Now the prawns are turning red after about three minutes of frying. Ensure that the heads are nicely cooked so that the innards of the head are all are nicely cooked as well and doesn't float out when the soup is being boiled or the broth is being boiled. Next, I will add in hot water and then I'll add in uh, pork bones to the broth. We'll add in like a, a litre of hot water. Here's a litre of hot water. As the soup is boiling, I'll add in the pork bones. Be careful. Add in gently. We'll let it brew till the soup is nice and uh, uh, thick. I'll just cook the cuttlefish in the hot broth for a while. Very quickly. If not, it'll be too chewy. Hi, this is Cooking Mama. Today I'll be frying Hokkien Mee. Uh, I've already showed you how I prepared the broth. Uh, now is the ingredients proper. I have one packet of uh, yellow noodles. Today the market is closed, so we bought it from the supermarket. That's about 420 grams. So I put lesser bihun, just a handful. Uh, I bought this uh, tauge. I just put a little bit, handful as well. This I prepared, which I've showed you earlier and then the chives i'm going to boil the prawn which i've already peeled and uh, cleared the the gut okay some people peel, uh, peel the gut from the top i also peel from the bottom uh, so that's basically it and the process will be shown in a while hi do note that this broth uh, has been seasoned with a tablespoon of salt and a tablespoon of sugar. I've poured in about six to eight tablespoons of vegetable oil. No worries for eating too much oil. That's the amount of oil that you would need to fry Hokkien Mee. I'll be using four eggs for this. Meanwhile, I heat up the broth so that it's hot and uh, so I don't want the, the egg to be too dry. So I put in the eggs when the temperature of the oil isn't too hot yet. Put in the noodle first. We 
let it both cook together. Yeah, put in a little bit of oil to fry a bit of garlic. We let the garlic cook. I'll put in the bihun. Warm it up first. Well, the noodle is being charred at the edge of the wok and the garlic is being nicely cooked. Nicely browning. The garlic is now nicely browning. And I'll put in the ingredients in. I like to mix the pork together with the garlic. It's very tasty. You notice I've not put in the seafood. The seafood cooks very fast and I don't want to overcook it. And I'll add in the tau gay, the bean sprout. Gravy now.
get my Hokkien noodle wet and mushy. Some of you don't want to put uh, too much gravy, that's fine. 